Let's balance the equation for SO3 plus KOH. This is sulfur trioxide and we have potassium hydroxide. So the first thing we'll do, we'll count the atoms up and then balance the equation. We have one sulfur atom, then we have three oxygen atoms, but be careful because there's an oxygen atom right here in the potassium hydroxide. So we have four oxygen atoms, one potassium and one hydrogen. On the product side, we have the sulfur. We have one of those, four oxygen atoms, and then one potassium and one hydrogen. If you look at these coefficients, they're all the same. That means that this equation is already balanced. We have one sulfur on each side, four oxygens on each side, and then potassium and hydrogen. So this is the balanced equation for SO3 plus KOH. If you were asked to report the coefficients, you could say one, 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 but we don't usually write those. If you're having problems with this, it probably was right here where you didn't count up all of the oxygen atoms. This is Dr. V with the balanced equation for sulfur trioxide plus potassium hydroxide. Thanks for watching.